Hello people, uh, this is Vikas Ahmed and uh, today I'm here to guide you people that how you can actually add your files to the exception list of uh, your antivirus that is not 32 version 4. So uh, it's a bit tricky here in this uh, antivirus so people are always wondering that uh, how to do it. Once I show you how you can do it, you're gonna bang your head because this is so easy. So you would come and enter the advanced setup here and uh, if the options are not available uh, make sure you change your mode here because by default it is actually set to the standard mode so you would need to change it to the advanced mode first okay so once you change it to the advanced mode you would come here into the setup and uh, you would have a drop down menu and then you would have an access to advanced setup or you can uh, access it by just pressing the F5 key that is the function key at your uh, keyboard at the top. So here um, you would have uh, exclusions here. Okay. So as you can see, I've already added few files here. So just to give you a bit of demo, I'm gonna delete this uh, exception from here. So why we're we doing it? Uh, so that uh, our antivirus doesn't bother anymore. Uh, about these applications that we have added uh, here to the exclusion. Well, uh, the right now what I had added was actually autoclubrevolution.exe. Uh, that was the launcher. Why did I do that? Because I I was having difficulties playing my game online, so I I thought of adding it to the exclusion. That's why I'm doing it. So you would add and uh, you would go where your file, where your application is. Okay, so in my case, it is in program files, ACR, and uh, other club bin folder, and, uh, and, 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 and here is my ACR.exe. I would click it, click the OK button, and here it is. Okay, so that's how you do it. You click the OK button, and you are good to go. So, thanks for watching. Uh, I hope it might have helped you and uh, please don't forget to leave a comment if you have uh, any problems and uh, thanks for watching.